G'day guys and welcome back to another video on my channel Nintendo Down Under. We have something so special today. I have been looking forward to this unboxing. I've been looking forward to this release date because this thing looks beautiful. We have the Splatoon 3 Nintendo Switch OLED Edition and the colors on this when I saw it launch saying this is what's going to come out. I was like, damn, I'm pre-ordering this. I cannot wait. And also, excuse the background noise. You can probably hear lots of... So the council right now is cutting all the lawns and curbs and parks near my house. So it's really loud, so I do apologize for that background noise. I can't do much about that. But we're not here for the noise. We're here because we want to have a look at this masterpiece of a Nintendo Switch. We want to have a look and see what this thing looks like. I am so excited to get my hands on this. Ah, uh, looks absolutely beautiful. So I have a bit of a closer Shania look at the box. The artwork on this looks fantastic. The A few years ago, they were pumping out Nintendo Switch special editions and different colors and Switch lights. It was quite often. It's definitely slowing down now, I think, with COVID and, you know, world delays in terms of getting microchips and this and that and parts. It's getting really hard. So... Finally, we have a new Switch unboxing, a new different special edition. The artwork, like I said, is beautiful. And it's not just a plain gray one or white one. We've got some color, guys. Look at these Joy-Cons. We've got the big paint splat on the white sort of looking Switch there as well with the pattern. We've got a few bit more color on the side here. Um, and on the bottom, nothing too fancy. And the red Nintendo Switch. Yes, yes, that's cool. Box, blah, blah, blah. Let's have a look inside, though and have an absolute gander of this masterpiece. Ah, oh, it looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, so keen. We'll unbox this nice and carefully, nice and gently. I know I've banged on about it so many times if you watch previous videos, but as we're doing it, please guys, every bit of plastic you see, every bit of cardboard you see, every bit of anything you see, my goodness, don't throw away, keep because it's important for complete in box if you're collecting. I want to open this upside down, that would have been terrible. And as we can see, these Joy-Cons, this is what I'm most excited about, is these Joy-Cons. These look so, so nice and clean, guys. We'll have a closer look at that. Have a little gander at that. Nice, beautiful purple artwork over there. We've got some artwork underneath, if you guys can see there as well. Beautiful, nice and clean, fair dinkum, good stuff. Let's get the nice neon yellowy green, that mellow yellow sort of look. Ah, oh, fantastic. Put the baggie to the side and have a closer little gander at that. Don't those colors just look amazing and work really awesome? I love. I think green and yellow are my favorite colors. And again, some more artwork on the back there as well. And these are what the two Joy-Cons together look like. Beautiful color, absolutely beautiful colors. It just looks amazing. We'll put that gently to the side. We'll get our Switch sort of, and here's our Nintendo Switch safety manual light. Not that very interesting. Let's have a look at the actual Switch itself. Like I said, Things like this, guys, baggies, plastic. I know I've banged on about it, but if you're new, save it, don't throw it, keep it preserved and safe. So the nice, beautiful, crisp, nice, clean OLED screen in the back, I don't wanna get fingerprints on this, is we've got some pattern work, as you can see here, which looks really, really good. We might quickly chuck the Joy-Cons on before we get the deck out so we can have a look and have a look and see how this looks. Ah. Oh. With that nice, black, crisp, clean OLED screen with these bright colors, it just makes it pop. Have a look at that. Doesn't that make you wanna just buy it and get it? And oh, I don't know, like it looks fantastic. Rapidly becoming my favorite one. And obviously now with these Switch OLED screens, they're bigger, so we have a better stand at the back. So when we're gaming, we can just stand it up nicely like that. If you guys probably can't see very well, but there's the stand. We'll set it up hands-free, no worries at all. All right, we'll put that just to the side for a second, very gently. Let's try and keep it on screen for you guys to have a look. Let's get out the dock. 
I was about to say the deck. Let's get out the deck, the dock. So put this bit of cardboard to the side as we do it. Um, so you guys can see, uh, there's all our cables and stuff under this bit of cardboard. Keep that cardboard. Bubble wrap is the dock. We'll get that out. Oh, hey, the box almost went flying. Careful, John, careful. And yes, <laughs> that was a bit of a nerve wracking moment. Um, but we're gonna keep all the cables in there because we know what cables look like, not that very exciting. But just showing you what the inside of an OLED box looks like if you've never seen one before. And we'll put that gently, uh, we'll just stand it like that. So you can have a look see as well. All right, let's get the dock out because this looks exciting as well. Again, it's just bubble wrap to you, but again, if you're a completionist and collector, keep it all, keep it safe, keep it preserved. You wanna sell it in five, 10, 20 years time, you can sell it exactly the way it was unboxed right now and charge that little bit more than someone else selling the same thing who doesn't have this stuff. Um, we'll get this gently out as well. It's all packed nicely and carefully and safely. And god damn, does this thing look clean? Does this thing look sensational? That matte white color with the splatoon patterns all over it. That yellow splat of the paint on there as well. Amazing. There is the back of the dock as well, the same sort of pattern. They've definitely tried to really spice this up, make it interesting if you want a special edition. You want your friends coming around and say, oh, look at your Switch, that looks awesome. That's what they're trying to do really here. And they're really looking after someone like myself who loves collecting different variants of stuff. So now we'll tuck in and pick it up gently. We'll tuck in our stand just like that. We'll make sure we face the, the dock the right way. I'll pick it up and just give you a closer look as well. And we'll gently, guys, gently place this how it's meant to be placed. Nice and carefully, no scratches, no bumps. And that there is how it all comes together. Our Nintendo Switch Splatoon OLED Special Edition. The colors, it's popping, it's looking good. I'm loving it. I can add this to my other Switch OLED collection now. We'll put that gently down here as well. We've got the box, we've got the bubble wrap and baggies, we've got it all, we are keen. Getting ourselves hyped for the game. The game's not out yet. It's just getting us more excited for Splatoon 3. Looking forward to that. But in the comments down below, guys, let me know your thoughts on this beautiful new OLED Splatoon 3 Nintendo Switch. The box is amazing. Have you pre-ordered it? Would you like to pick this up? Are you excited for the game? Let's get those comments going. Let's get the discussion going. Very keen and excited to read your feedback in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching guys and until next time, take care.